Today, we investigate the Philippines' most haunted hotel where hundreds of innocent lives were slaughtered, and we believe their spirits still linger here to this day. Yup, that was behind me. We're being followed, bro. Oh, how accurate is this, guys? There is no wind, though. Is it because they're warning us from up here? They don't want us to go upstairs. That is what this whole thing's about. Europe, what is up, explorers? We are here in the Philippines in Baguio, and I am here with Zarkaru Vlogs. What's up, guys? Now, Zarkaru, you've been here before, and you filmed the Diplomat yeah, Hotel. Yeah, a couple of times, a couple of times, and many things happened here. Multiple, multiple encounters of some creepy stuffs. Would you say this is one of the most haunted places you've I could ever say, been to? I could say. Here wow. in the Philippines, dude, this is the most haunted, I think, the most haunted place I've ever been here in the Philippines. Many, many things happened. Many things happened. Wow, okay. Yeah. So let me just tell you some stuff, guys. When I first got here to the Philippines, people at the gas register was saying, hey, you should go to the Diplomat Hotel yeah. from your video. Yeah. Yeah. So that's how crazy this is. In 1911, American friars in the Dominican order made plans for the construction of a vacation house for them and the nuns in Baguio. It was built in year 1913 and served as a school in 1915 for only two years before being reverted back to its other use. Then in World War II, it was invaded by the Japanese army so they could make a base out of it. During that time, the Japanese army and police killed everyone in there. When Japan lost the war, the building was restored and converted to a hotel in 1973. Due to the death of the owner, Antonio Agapito, in 1987, the hotel ceased operations. So again, just that alone probably caused so much dark energy it is. in the Diplomat Hotel. It is. A such beautiful luxury hotel only stayed open for 10 years that looks over all of Baguio. It's pretty crazy. So. I, you know, a lot of people believe it's because, you know, there was bad luck here from all the destruction and stuff that happened here. The sadness brought the bad luck. Some people believe it's just because, you know, there was no more money to fund this place anymore. They couldn't keep it open. There's a lot of different rumors and legends that go on. All right, what is up, guys? Obviously, we have Zark here. We got slang here and we have rich who's in the car right now but i told him he's he says he's gonna come when we start the ghost part so for now he's in the car so again very cool spot on the outside actually actually really quick i gotta go to the front let me show you guys this we missed a lot right over here i want to show you guys first off i'm super excited to be here because apparently this really is one of the most haunted places in all of philippines and to be honest by the history my god it kind of scares me, bro. Yo, as you can see, bro, uh -huh. there's, there's some black stains right here. Yeah. All over the place, because before it was, it got on fire. I don't oh. know where, they don't know what was the reason, if it's arson or what, but it got on fire. But you know what? It's still standing, and that's what's amazing. And if you look up, what's freaky is the cross. And, okay, dang. So, a lot of places I explore, it's actually really cool actually really quick because the history is because in Philippines the Spanish took over at one point so this is the era when the Spanish took over so it's really cool how you're going to see uh, architecture from you know Asia architecture or Philippine architecture into Spanish architecture and this is one of the Spanish architecture buildings. Um, I, I couldn't see where I was going but already when you come inside it's all creepy carvings and scratches all around here and this before, door. Before it's open to the public but after the pandemic and then this earthquake happened, magnitude seven, so they closed the the whole area 
because it's not safe going inside so this is a special trip for us we're the only one that got permitted to enter inside this diplomat well I mean you're already starting off and as we explore this is exploring first I don't want to just rush into the ghost stuff because I like to see what we're about to get ourselves into but this must be one of the old original doors Probably. yeah the Dominicans built before and now but you can see how they, what it, so during the day, this is now like almost like a museum where you guys can kind of walk through it, which is why you're gonna see uh, stuff like this. Wow, you think these are original doors? I wonder. Uh, oh, they're not? Okay. I was gonna say, cause that would be nuts. Oh, dude. That is a big one. Look at this. When you come out in here, this took me by surprise. Zark, what is that? Uh, before uh, they made this to an art museum. At one time? Yeah, at one time. But... Oh, so after the hotel? Yeah, after the hotel. Just lately, maybe, I think maybe 2015, something like that. Dang. And it's just sitting here. It's actually really cool to see in person, but it's just like, wow, that's all abandoned now with the fountain. This, and it's the original fountain for the hotel, though, obviously. So when the hotel was built, they built the fountain in the middle in the courtyard. So this is a room where? Of a kid, uh -huh. girl kid, that many people sees a, a ghost of the girl kid mm -hmm. in the fountains. I don't know if this fountain or that fountain, but when we shoot, so I was shooting with this um, tele television in, in the United States. Okay. So there's an audio man be besides me, and when he turned his head, he saw the kid. So he, he, oh, he, wow. Right oh, wait, you really are. Yeah, because of that. There's a lot of just dark energy if you, once you put everything together about what happened, the history, and you know, it, yeah, it's definitely scary. Everything's been scrapped out. It's just a shell now. Literally just a shell. Oh, so it could be that courtyard or this courtyard with the fountain. And this one also caught on fire at one point. Look how black yeah. it looks. So this whole place was just burning, which is also why it's probably gutted. You know, there's not even any wood left. This marble floor is definitely at least original to the 1970s hotel. Oh, there's the second floor too. Obviously, we did see that. but So these were some of the rooms of the hotel. You know, they're not numbered anymore. There's no more doors, uh, but... It's just little things. Oh yeah, so you would have your room, which feels like you're almost in a church because, well, technically, but the retreat home, but still. Anyways, yeah, check out the tiles. Those old this Spanish architect. Yeah. The hotel. Yeah, old Spanish tiles. The architecture's still standing, 1970s. Now, I'm surprised you're not, like you're still walking through here, bro, after you had all your crazy times. Dude, everything is crazy, even the equipments. <laughs> Go went crazy. Even the ghost stalker, bro. Uh huh. Talks about the demon and it's connected. Everything Damn. is all connected, bro. Jeez, yeah. Okay, look how big this room is. Maybe for the family rooms. The bathroom here is a little different colors from the other one too. Again, the windows are wide open, so when we ghost hunt, make sure you uh, keep in mind that could be a dog barking or horns or something outside. Look at that. Spooky, which way to go? You will see the old carpets of the hotel right here. Oh, carpets? Yeah, it was still here. This one. Oh wow, so they ripped them up and chucked them in here. So they were red for luxuriness or something, huh? Yeah. Just a nice red carpet, nice room. Yeah, for the 1970s, that's not bad. I think that's older than us. Oh, definitely is. Even me, bro, and I'm old. Let's see from the what's the what's the courtyard look like from up here? Whoa. Man, imagine though not knowing the history coming in here and just feeling weird, but when you know the history and you're in here, you're just like, geez, this huh. So before, <laughs> when we explored this, we saw a black lady in the The oh. corner? I mentioned the black lady, bro. I know. Now again, that could have been outside, but that was pretty freaky. Yeah, so we saw the black lady here in the window, and the thing is, dude, before, 
after we because mm. when we saw it i want to mm-hmm. check it out yeah and when i tried to open it it's closed oh what the hell and the, then the guard told me that every room is open and then yeah yeah this one was closed and look how, how big it is oh so this one they added windows too talking about the construction and all the periods Stepping into this room, though. Dude, I could see how being in here alone is actually pretty creepy. So I love this, though. Check out the architecture here. So it's not connected, though, but you have to go downstairs to come back up to go to the other section, though. Almost like a little maze, but I love how they did this, like, U-shape. Mm-hmm. I think the other side is the dining and Something like the that. dining hall? Event place? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's go check out the dining hall. So right here, dude, look at this. Check this out. Yeah. Well, right first here, off... The floor is still here. And this is the only, this is the only room that has a chimney. Dude, we should try something here in this Yo. room. Yeah, the floor is still here. Wow. Mm-hmm. So it wasn't really burned or touched by the fire. Yeah, there's a lot of different things here that's different. Oh, what the hell? Spin dog. Interesting. So one of the things I like when I do ghost videos, I, we like to explore, learn about the place. Obviously, because Dark Spen here, he gets to teach us and show us some other things in his experiences. And then we get to kind of get a good feel of it before we just ghost hunt right away into it. And one thing, um, they says that this place has an underground. Oh, what? Have you yeah, found yeah, it? Yeah, I, I didn't found it, but... I didn't... Um, I think it's... Down there, and they already sealed it. Sealed it. Yeah. yeah. Well, I think that's a good little tour of the place, guys. It's not massive. It's packed with action history, and it's just perfect enough to get a nice, crazy video in here and a crazy experience. I think. Let's see how our night is and how active this place is. And again, first off, we are in Asia. You guys know, and especially here in the Philippines, everyone here is crazy about spiritualness and, and their culture of believing ghosts. And a lot of haunted places are here in all Asia and especially here in the Philippines. So again, when I wanted to come here and make these ghost videos for Beyond the Dark, I knew I had to stop here in the Philippines because it's nuts. Dude, explorers, check this out, ready? Oh my God, bro. Yo, oh my bad, I don't wanna lock you in. No. Actually, kinda do. <laughs> please subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, but Make it George still 10 mil. Yes, Yo. please give me the 10 mil. 10 but mil. watch this, ready? Imagine hearing that at night when no one's around. Dude, imagine hearing that later when we investigate. If that happens, I might run out. No, actually, I wouldn't. I would come right here with a DR60 and talk to the ghost and ask, why'd you do that? That's what I would do. That's what a ghost hunter would do, right? I love these stairs. A nice, like, spiral almost staircase. This is my first time going here. So, is this what you think the dining hall could be? Yeah, it could be. Looks like this is where it would be. You would sit down, grab your food, your lunch. This is already going to be. Right. That's my... Oh, Bro, that's the first time my foot went through anything <laughs> and that wasn't even a big hole. All right, we are back outside now. We're grabbing our ghost gear, getting all our stuff ready. This is about to get insane. Or is it? Or is it? We'll see. Now, Rich, you've been hanging out with me doing ghost videos for a little bit now since we've been in Asia. What has been your take on ghost stuff in general now? In general, I mean, with you, we get like crazy evidence and stuff, so like, Coming from where I am, being extremely skeptical, I am definitely way more open to it. Yeah. Like the, the timing and the accuracy with some of the responses and yeah, everything is kind of crazy. The first, when I first I, met Rich, he was so skeptic until something happened in the <laughs> tunnel in Japan. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> all right, that's one thing. Like, okay, yeah, and that's before we hung out for ghost before. videos too. So what happened yeah. there in Japan is we saw a big shadow, not just Dude, me, both not of just us him. Together both at the okay. exact same time, Dang. screamed and ran. S- screamed and ran. Oh, oh what the hell? Same oh, exact thing. That was, that was nice. my personal craziest experience because we weren't really expecting anything. Yeah. We were just like walking up and just all of a sudden we saw it. Yeah, no, that's, but, that's also pretty intense. I wish yeah. I seen that, but. I am excited to see what we get here though.
check out my new clothes in the link in description down below. Literally lunging my backpack and my other backpack. Oh, inside to go start this. So we are starting the ghost investigation and we are starting it here in the main lobby. I felt like when the Japanese did invade this place and they did slaughter everyone, I assume a lot of people were running in and out of the main lobby before they were getting shot. So I'm assuming right here would be a good you know, spot where things could happen. Um, we do have all the ghosts here and I think we should set up. So maybe you guys want to take some stuff and place it. Okay. We do have a lot of things at this point today. The dead bell, the music box. My favorite, box. <laughs> my favorite. Dude, this dead bell has been doing so good on our ghost investigations, and it has been so accurate. It is. We've been it doing, uh, what though? We've been doing yes, or no. yes for one, yes, and then two for no. So, and it's been doing the two taps and the one taps. It is very accurate. So good, so good. So, I mean, to start it off too, I'm gonna place it right here in the center. Oh wait, this is probably the center. And then we'll place this one on the courtyard entrance, just in case. All right, we are now fully set up. We're ready to investigate. We got the dead bell, the music box, the other music box, the REM pod, the new Tracer 2.0, the cat balls, Zark, <laughs> the, the triangle. I see. I'm trying to remember everything at once. And the other music. Box. The other music. Yeah, I said that. <gasps> oh, yeah, oh yeah, the, Every time I say the dead bell, it goes off. The devil, dude. Yeah. All right. Well, let's start by introducing ourselves. My name's Josh. I'm from the United States of America. I heard about your story and what happened here, and I'm really sad about that. And I'm sorry for you guys. And I'm here to kind of just get to know you guys and talk. I am Zark. I'm si Zark. Taka dito sa Pilipinas. I'm from the Philippines. Hello, I am Rich, uh -huh. also from the United States. Yeah, just here, I'm curious, I wanna learn. Now, I put a lot of devices around here, including with all my friends. We laid down a bell that you can kind of tap and make sounds, which one of you guys already know about. Stuff with the REM part that you can touch and light up with just your hands. Stuff over there, over here, that lights up. All you gotta do is press and touch anything. These devices will not hurt you, they won't harm you, and it's a way that we can talk to you and understand your story if you know, to know what happened here. Um, if anyone is here, would you touch one of our devices to let me know? Do you need me to transcribe it to Tagalog? Probably, right? It's a good way. Is there anyone with us right now? If anyone is upstairs, can you please come down here? We're trying to talk to you. Anyone. We're in the center of the whole place. I heard what happened about the Japanese army. I heard what happened about the doctor that used to operate on you with no anesthesia. Many of you have died. I'm sorry about that. It's like metal going across the floor. Yeah. It's always hard. There's so much rattles that I don't know. It's a possibility, yeah. Oh, wait, let say that Oh. Every time we bring the dead bell up, it goes off. So I ask this, is it okay to you that we're here? Okay. Yes. So the bell on the floor, one tap for the ring is yes, two taps for the bell to go off is no. Is the ring of bell is yes. Dalawang ring, ibig sabihin na hindi. Okay lang ba? Were you a nun here? Madre ka ba dito dati? Isa ka ba sa mga Pilipinong nahirapan dati? Are you one with the... Are, are you one with the Filipinos that got enslaved? Were you murdered here by the Japanese army? Napatay ka ba dito ng mga Japanese? Holy f It's from the entrance. Oh. But dude, dude, dude that was like a you, dude, you heard it, you heard it. Someone went right up to the entrance. Yeah. Dude, 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 that has never happened with it's, my device. Like from Only far ever. going yes. here. Far to close. That means someone either just walked in here or something. Because we invited them. Yeah. 
You're, you're all invited here. We're trying to have a conversation in the center. We, we mean no harm. Whether you're a priest, a nun, a, 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 Yes, yes. You're going inside. Dude, that's I've never, never had that happen. That's never done that. Never. Oh! The bell just went off too. It's starting, it's starting now. Welcome kayo dito. You guys are welcome here. Um, andito kami para makipag-usap. Wala kami dito para, mang, para manggambala. We are here just for a talk. We're not here to harm you guys. Yung mga nilagay namin, hindi kayo mapapahamak dyan. Hindi, hindi kayo magagambala niyan. Wow. Dude, oh my god. This is just a tool. Tool lang to para makipag-communicate sa inyo. You're, are you standing right outside of there? You can come closer to here. Do you want to move? I, I think it's active there. there. Because you know why? On my first time here, I, I, I placed a walkie-talkie there. Uh -huh. and, and a walkie-talkie on our tent. And dude, it starts speaking with something like a girl voice, right Slang? You mm -hmm. remember that? When I placed a walkie-talkie, it's just a two-way walkie-talkie. But dude, it ends up like someone was talking to us. Should I try the DR60 over there? Oh, depends. If they wanted to move the bell over there for a little bit, should we move the bell? I mean, that means we would have to. Let's move the bell. Let's move the bell and leave our stuff here. That's that could be something. My my thought is, I'm thinking is that they're scared to come in here because of trauma. The trauma, yeah. The trauma is what I'm thinking of. So maybe trauma. Yes. Yeah, they are scared to come in here. Some of the spirits are scared of going inside. Uh, or, or were there any, were there any evil people maybe in here that could have been, or maybe the doctor? But no, I don't think so. There was really nothing. And also, because when we, we, when we've been here before, there's a spirit that is warning us, and there's this also a spirit that is daring us to go. Oh yes. Yeah. So do you remember Zark? Na alam po ba ako? Yes. Yes. Dude, instant response. It's probably, I guess I, I went here a couple many times. Right, so they know and you. And what we always do is pray for them after we do the investigations. Wow. Okay. So, were you killed by the Japanese? Napatay ka ba ng mga Japanese? Yes. Wow. Instant freaking... As soon as we move yeah. the devil to where the activity is. Okay. Yes. <laughs> um, okay, so are you scared of anyone inside the building? Yes. PTSD trauma and they're scared of some some people in here. Okay. Are you not allowed to come in here? Wait, is there so, like some like spell or um, wait, wait. Or something? Are you a good spirit? I feel like they won't answer that. Jeez. <laughs> I feel like even if they're a bad, they're gonna I say think, they're good. I think, I think. Nakausap na bakit na dati? Did we already have a conversation before? Let me get this. Yes. So I do feel... Oh, wait, wait. I think he's the one that we talked before upstairs. A good spirit that is warning us not to go on the second floor. Because there is a bad spirit on the second floor. Probably on this room. Okay. And, he's, and she is warning us not to go. Is that and true? Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see. Right? Oh! It was like, dang, dang, dang. It so, was like a, dang, is that two for no? Or was that like, no, 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 or yes, yes, yes? Are you the spirit that is warning us? Yes. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. So, spirit. should we just leave this place? Should we go get answers in the courtyard? <gasps> F crazy. 
hanging right outside that entrance door that can't come in. They're so close. Are you just looking right at us? Like, right at this gate door? Tinitignan mo lang ba kami na nandiyan ka lang sa gate ngayon? Oh my god! I'm the same Reaching into the gate to hit the bell or something. How accurate is this, guys? Seriously. Very accurate, bro. This is the first time that the triangle went off. Yeah. With the bell. Together. With the bell. I know. Are you sitting besides the triangle? Nakaupo ka ba sa tabi ng triangle? Hit the bell. Okay, thank you. <laughs> so he's oh sitting. Oh my god! He or she is sitting. Oh my the god! Bell. Oh yes. Um, all right, all right, all right. I'm I'm smiling about how amazing this is, but at the same time, let's try. I want to get more answers. Um, is it possible that we can go to the courtyard to try to find people to talk to? What do you say happened in the second courtyard? So what happened? Oh, second floor? No, the courtyard in there. You said it's haunted. So uh, yeah, there's a girl. There's a girl in this in the in the in the fountain. Oh, it's going crazy over that. Mm -hmm. What's the girl's name? Do we know? Um, I think oh, it's. Yep. As I remember, I think Emily. Emily? Is there a girl named? Yep. Whoa. Yeah, that's what I remember. So that thing. Um. So before I went here with the net, the television from United States. So what the psychic psychic um what the psychic feels then um he she he she she heard this name Emily okay. and then when when I did my uh, own investigation here what comes with the um half is Emily Oh okay all right so yeah. So, oh, so it said Emily and then your app even said Emily. Yeah. Okay, so that's two Emilys. Well, let's go inside the court, the second courtyard. And again, you're more than welcome. Yup, you're more than welcome to join us if you want to. And we'll just figure that out. I got it. The music box, as you walked over there, just went off. I missed it. All right. Well, either way, I'm grabbing the tripod. He's reloading the new battery. Yup. Yep. See, bro, the sign as they want us to go into the fountain. Right there. Dude. No way. No fucking way. The second one just went off. Yeah. And that one. They literally want us to go through the fountain doors. That was me. Look. Look at that. And the after. Check this out. Oh. So it's like a welcome? Is yes! A welcome? I don't know, they- dude, you can't get any more welcoming than that! That's creepy. That wasn't going off the whole time! It's not. Is Explorers! This was not going off the whole time over there! As yeah. soon as we packed our gear, now it's happening! It, it, whoa, dude. That might be... That might be one of the coolest things that have ever happened. Wow, thank you guys. All right, we gotta, we gotta be talking to someone over here. Oh my God, let's just, all right guys, let's just take the stuff through here. I'm gonna, I just moved it. Let's just bring it all in here. They literally are welcoming us in here, I'm assuming. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to take the DR60 out. This is too much. Don't ever touch the water, okay? I know I won't. Remember guys, just to show you guys this. That's what was happening by the door. You can't fake that. Like, tsh, unbelievable. All right, well, really quick. If you are here by the fountain now, you obviously gave us the most best grateful opening, I'm assuming to come in here, unless it's like, don't come in here, don't go through here, beep, beep, get out of here. Is, is this okay that we're here? Okay, I'm gonna need to I heard there was a little girl here named Emily. I just heard walking in that hallway. I do too. Yeah, I do. Are you watching us through the courtyard, Emily? Oh, 
Again, if any nurses or priests, doctors, Nuns. soldiers are here, you're more than welcome to join us here by the fountain. Maybe sit on the fountain and hang out with us. Kung meron doktor, nurse, sundalo na spirit na nandito, pwede kang sumama dito sa amin, pwede kang makipag-usap. Maybe she got the DR. I don't know if I have to explain what this is anymore, but just in case, this is a DR60. It was made in 1990, uh, 1980, and it was only made for one year before uh, Panasonic decided to just stop using them because um, what happened was is people kept using them and they kept getting different voices that wasn't theirs, things that sounded different, some screeches, some scratches, but also different voices. So it worked, but it had an issue. So they stopped it and they made a new one, but the new one stopped having these voices. So people think that because this was made in a certain way and some sort of certain frequency, they were able to talk to the afterlife. You wanna know the craziest thing? It's been on the whole time, it didn't even go off once, which shows it's actually working. What would be weird if I put it somewhere different than? Maybe right here, literally. Yeah. All right. Let's see what happens if we sit here and actually ask questions. I'm actually, all right, right here. One, two, three. Is there someone named Emily here? Meron ba ditong Emily yung pangalan? Kasama ba kaming Emily yung pangalan? If there's another spirit here, what is your name? Kung may ibang spirito kaming kasama, anong pangalan mo? Is this place evil? Yo, I don't know if it's on my, my imagination, but I literally saw a shadow passing by. I don't know if it gets the camera. It, it could or maybe it, it oh, could be. I, I know what it is. Uh, to debunk this, it's because the shadow rich. Maybe. Rich moved and the, our light is pointing. That's why. Probably. Yeah. I'll show you. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. But good eyes. Yeah. Alright, so we'll listen to these two questions and play them back. So for this, what I usually do is I come right up to it, so you, that picks it up from here. Is there someone named Emily here? Yes? <gasps> Holy this And it was people talking before that mm -hmm. in a weird voice. Yo, soft and hang on, I'm bringing this up to the camera. It's gonna be... Yes, there is. Yes. Get out, maybe? Is that Emily? It sounded very soft for something else at the end. Dude, there is so much people talking in it, watch. Yeah. Wow, okay. What the hell was that? Dude. So, I heard yes, I heard yes there is, I almost sound like I heard Emily, a bunch of different people, but voice. That sounds like a beast. I heard in the first one, voices. yes there is, and then another person said yes. And yeah. that's when I asked if Emily was here. So that was two different people saying that. Actually, there's a lot. A lot of people died here. Mm. Unless they're trying to keep us away from a certain place. Let's ask that, because it could be your thing. Don't go on the second floor. Mm. Let's, let's ask that. One, two, three. Is there someone that's stopping us from going to the second floor? Ay pumipigil ba sa aming pumunta ng second floor?
Is there someone over here? If there is, can you say your name? Meron bang spirito dito malapit sa puno? Kung meron anong pangalan mo, pwede mo sabihin? Is there someone evil here? May masamang espiritu pa dito? Andito pa banda yung basement? Okay, I'll play it back. Let's listen to this one. Is there someone that's stopping us from going to the second floor? Yes. Meron. Yes. There's a loud yes. Is there What was that? Can you play it back again? That's a f girl's voice. Yes, that was a girl's voice. It's like right behind. Yes. They keep talking like so much, but it's like some of it is all one word. Some of it's almost like I can't understand. But that one was a girl's whisper voice. Mm -hmm. It is. But I don't and know I what asked, they're saying. I ask if um, it's the basement somewhere here. So if that's what was a girl's voice saying that. Dude, I look don't at know. this. I'm having this freaking Whoa. goosebumps all over my arm. A lot of it we can't fully make out, so I don't know what they're fully saying, but some of it does say yes, and for sure. Um, again, I don't know. I don't know in Tagala if you heard too, some stuff or not, but it's so weird. All right, screw it. Obviously, they don't want us to go upstairs, it seems like. Mm -hmm. Should we go up? Yeah. <sighs> Risky, so, but we're already here. We traveled miles and miles. I know. All right, so for this one, I won't even use audio, like a mic, but it'll just be you two, so we won't talk. It'll be okay just for this segment. Who's that? It's the REM pod. REM pod's going off? Dude, the REM pod is going off now we're as we're about to go upstairs for the first, yeah. They don't want us to go upstairs. That is what this whole thing's about. Can you step away? Can you come back? Do you want to go? Oh, dude! Oh, no. Are you... We are about to go upstairs. And we're going to have a device that's going to allow you to talk to us. We're going to ask you questions upstairs. They don't want us to go, bro. Step away from the REM pod if you don't want us to go upstairs. Yo! That was in Tagalog to understand. Shit. <laughs> Yo! That was in So what? I asked the question. It, I, I, I said that. If you don't want to go upstairs, can you step away from the REM pod? Oh, and that's what you said. Yeah. I just transcribed it in Tagalog. Oh. So this, dude, this is all making clear sense. Yeah. You don't want us to go up. That's, then that means when no, those no, went no, off. No, no, that means when those went off down there, they were telling us not to go through. Yeah. The REM pod's going off again. They're definitely trying to get our attention. Dude, I heard the... I just, I think this camera caught it. It was like a huge thump. Oh, shit. <gasps> oh. What was that? Dude, and it was louder the first time, but you guys didn't hear it. It was a whole vibration. I'm surprised you didn't hear that. That was shit. Just... And now that's going off again. Dude. Dude, this Yo. Thump, this thump comes from the door. When I said you saw the black lady. Oh, that's where you guys should go. You guys are about to, you guys. All right, so Rich, you guys, you and Slang are gonna go upstairs, 
find the door and go inside and see if you can speak to the this post be rumors that there is a black lady but honestly just speak about any whoever it could be there okay good let's luck start, like, yeah i'm glad i'm not going alone when we go upstairs let's try to be really quiet to see if we can hear anything else if okay. that bang happens again while we're going upstairs while we're walking up the stairs and we're coming back, <laughs> we're coming back. <laughs> okay all right guys so while they're upstairs, and by the way, they're like the skeptics of the group. So while they're upstairs trying to get ghost information, we're down here and we lay down some devices, including a REM pod, a triangle, and some other stuff. We're gonna sit here, it's circling us, and see what could happen if there's anything around us. Oh. Literally, and the REM pod already went off a second ago, we didn't get to show it. So obviously if you hear them upstairs, it's okay, because they could be loud. Dude, it Something. is pitch black right now. We have no lights with us. Yeah. And we're gonna head over there to where the, the black lady is supposed to be. Yeah, yeah. Try to communicate with her. With her. Can we use. Oh! What's that? Did you see something? Yeah! I don't know it it is my Oh okay okay <sighs> Yeah it's my reflection Oh Yeah <laughs> Because there's a mirror right there right I don't think Yeah I think so That's a window Yeah Yeah straight up straight up there's a door right there Yeah is this the door right here? Straight go straight Yeah that's it That's oh it's open Yeah. Hello. Hello. Um, wow. Okay, so we're here. I think we'll just start by maybe introducing ourselves to the spirits that are here, maybe? Yeah. If there's a black lady here or something. This looks like it used to be like a classroom of some sort. Wait, wait, wait. I think we can go into close this door. You want to close the door? I don't know. Oh, no, 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 no. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Yeah, I think we need to open this yeah, yeah, yeah. widely. <laughs> yeah. Um. <laughs> if that closes on its own, I'm, I'm jumping out the window here. Yeah, me too. Me too. Me too. Okay, let's let's just ask. Okay. Let's finish this, bro. Let's finish this. Hello. If there are any spirits here, please communicate with us. We are trying to learn more about this place and we are, we don't mean any harm. Yeah. Okay, here we go. So let's just start off with basic questions. Are there any spirits with us here right now? Meron bang spirito kaming kasama dito ngayon? You're not gonna... Well, I'm gonna stop that. You're not gonna believe what I just saw. Because I don't even believe what I just saw. That was what? down the hallway. Because I'm looking out the door right now. I just, I just, I just saw this like, just like, like whip of light. <laughs> like the realistic part of my brain is saying it was probably Josh and Josh and Zark, you know, with the flashlights or something. But they're pretty far from us right now. And that was like, it looked like it just scanned across the hall. Oh, oh, Dude, that was so creepy. So creepy. Look at that. That's a Dude, pitch black. Really That's a pitch this. black, yeah. I don't know what happened there. I, I'm i gonna assume it was just some light bouncing off somewhere, but like that was really freaky. Yeah. All I did was ask the one question too. So let's see if we hear anything. <laughs> Wait. Can you can you play it back again? Are there any spirits with us here right now? Yes. Yes. Okay, so I'm yes. gonna, I wanted to follow up 
Yes. But I saw that light. All right, so there's some spirits here with us right now. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Let's ask, like, I don't know, how many questions are we going to ask? Um, okay, let me ask about... We heard about the lady in black. Are you the black lady spirit with us here right now? Ikaw ba yung black lady na nagpakita kay Rich ngayon? If there is any other spirit here, can you tell us if this place is evil? Pwede mo bang sabihin ang lugar na to ay isang karya ng demonyo? Guys, what's going on? Dude. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. We were talking. We haven't even listened to this back this for the second time yet. But we were talking to the spirit. And we asked if this place is evil. And then and we just loud fing bang. No, the, dude. Oh, yeah. You want in the room. You wanna know some crazy shit? Yeah. We heard the bang from here. <laughs> but that's how it happened. Oh, 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 oh. Crazy. That was right after we asked if there's anything evil here. Yeah. Oh, oh. Wait, did you play it back yet? No. No. Did you already stop recording it then? I, I tried. Okay. Wait, let's head over here and then let's listen to it back. Because oh. imagine if it says like something crazy and then the bang. And then the bang. Dude, I mean, we caught the bang on here the too. The bang is right oh. at the back. Yeah. Right so, here and then the bang is right there. Right there. Like very near. Okay. The bang. <laughs> yeah, and we have a POV here that, uh, we, is, that, sh that will show that we're here. All right, yeah, let's hear that back. Let's hear that back. I'm gonna keep this here. Oh. So one thing I'm curious, um, the loud bang, is it the door? No, no, bro, because we're in front of the door. The why that, that we, we don't close it because we just wanted to see it in the camera. Yeah. That if it is moving or not, that's mm. why we, we yeah. These so the door never banged. Yeah, the door never banged. So what the was that for us? Because like we tried to yeah, bang we tried to everything. Your replica. We, oh. we tried to bang the door. We tried to no, bang the uh, literally the, nothing the moved word. as far as we could see. We just dude. hear a loud ass bang after we ask a yeah. question of this evil here. And dude, again, just bringing that up because we obviously we just came from there. It's like. Zark and I tried banging the door and other stuff to figure it out. What? That? I don't understand how. That's unexplainable. That's a lot of dark There's energy to do that. There's nothing inside. Dude, alright. That was pretty. If that's real crazy evidence, what the f? Alright, anyway. Yo! Oh. Whoa. Whoa! And that's back outside, as you guys came back. And it always is triggering here. I don't get that. Let's pay that back. What's the DRCC? Actually, can I play it back? Yeah. Make it kind of easy. How many did you play? How many? Two. Only two, so I'm gonna go back to 80s. Okay. Oh.
Holy shit. So it's slang says it's a different question because slang says is it a uh, kingdom of the devil? And it's something. And like, that's when the bang happens. Yeah. Yeah. So I have a new light here now. You guys stay down here, and me and Zark's gonna go up to the same room yeah. to see if anything can happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. First off, what f- room are you guys at? <laughs> the door. The door. The door. The door. The door. Yeah. The door? The door. And that's the, the door. one you said. Yeah. All right, we're gonna do that with the night vision. Okay. There's no right. problem. Oh my god. <laughs> is... I like this. So guys, hit that subscribe button. Yeah. Run to find my love to my Let's go. Subscribe to all of us, guys. If you're new here and if you're still watching, cool. We're putting up this crazy energy and we're going hard. It is over midnight now, and we're still going hard. And you guys almost died from the devil. Yeah. <laughs> all right, switching from there to this one. They are really saying, "Don't go upstairs." They're doing everything they can to stop us. Yeah. Can you step away? But they go this. It's like someone is fun. Yeah. They don't want us to go. They're worried for us too, maybe. That one spirit's good down here. Wait, what the hell? Okay. Dude, I feel like it's Halloween with this vibe, bro. Yeah. Okay, that's the door right in front of us, right? Yeah. Okay, hang on. Should we? Did they, they? I don't even know if they went in. Guys, did you want inside? Okay. Let's okay, go we're inside. gonna go in. Okay. So, what's the possible source of the bang? That's what I'm trying to figure out, and we're. Or maybe. It can't be from the. Sure they move and then. Possible. It, that's possible. That sounds like it could have been something, but it was really loud. It's really, really yeah. Cool. Do you want to check the other room if mm. um, there's something to be back there? Yeah. All right. I'm gonna take my little light out as well with you to light this place up. Okay. No, nothing in here. Nothing in here. And that means well, it only came from this direction. Remember, they felt the vibration and everything. So it's still here or here. Absolutely nothing. So it has to be from that door, or they bang like the whiteboard. Probably the whiteboard. Wait, let me check, let me check. It's not. Oh! Does it sound like it? Huh. Oh! Wind? Wind? It's moving. There is no wind, Josh. There is no wind, though. Maybe? All right, We're, let's talk it out. Let's talk to them. I'm gonna shut that off. All right, lights are now off. It looks like you did appear to just move that door. Can you give us a bang like you gave to them? Is it an angry bang? Are you part of the... We're gonna ask you some questions. Wanna try? You know how to use this now? Yeah. All right. I'll talk in English too. Um, you can go first, Ash. And dito ba yung black lady na nakita namin noon? Is there someone evil here? May masamang espiritu ba dito ngayon? How many spirits are here? Ilang espiritu ang nandito ngayon? If you want us to leave, say the word leave. Kung gusto mo kaming umalis, sabihin mo ang salitang leave or alis. I think that's done. That's done. Oh, I will stop it. Okay. I'll play it back, make it easy.
So weird. Hard to make him out. Let's try it again. Yeah, let's try it again. Hang on, try holding this for a little. Okay. Okay. Let's go next to this door. It's weird because I'm feeling heavy though, in like a weird way. Like my head feels a little heavy. My stomach feels a little weird. So I don't know if that's them like trying to drain me or if that's just nothing. Let's go see if there's something over here. So I can't literally see anything. I don't see anything. If you're still here, the lady in black, give us a big bang, like you did for them. Kung nandito ka pa yung babaeng itim, pwede ka bang kumalabog ng kahit ano? Thing is, you're right about the door though. Remember, if it wasn't the wind, it did move. So we'll stand here this time. Are you standing in front of me? Nakatayo ka ba sa harap ni Josh? May gusto ko ba sabihin sa amin ngayon? Do you have something to say to us? I stopped it. Bro, I felt the craziest coldness come through here. It even like me, my arms all chill now. Oh my god. Bro, I wish I could show you my arms. Do they look, uh, maybe they don't look like it, but... Alright, I'm gonna play this back. It's a girl's voice. Oh my god, hang on, it said some more stuff. Hang on, listen hard. Oh my god, pause it. What, what, it says, oh, oh, nakatayo ako. What does that mean? Yes, I'm standing. And it's on the girl's voice. It is a girl's voice. Play it again, play I'm, it again. It's crazy. Hang on, alright, let's go. I'll play it back from the beginning. Dude, I can't even make that ending out. It's, they said like five words to us. Is this a sentence? Yeah, we can't make it out. Sometimes it happens a lot with the DR60s. There's something up here though. Even my stomach's really hurting a little bit. I'm feeling sick, bro. Like I actually feel sick. The lady in black, if that is you, please yell out your name as loud as you can. So, babaeng itim, kung nandito ka ngayon, sabihin mo yung pangalan mo na malakas. May demonyo ba dito ngayon? Is there a demon in here? Did we just hear you right here? Okay. Wow. This energy though in this place, bro, is really dark. Bro. It looks like they're standing right here. Dude, no, that's why I just looked. Yeah. yeah, it looks like someone's standing there. In a window? Yeah. In a window? Oh my god. Is there? Shit. Dude, it can't see. I mean, the night vision I, can see because of the aerial lights. It's my eyes too, though. Like, we can. We'll play this back. Bro, 
That was the, that was the craziest yes. Clear as day, yes. Like that. And dude, he, she yelled up her name. Let's, all right, let's, let's play it back one more time. We won't talk. Let's yeah, play yeah. it in the corner um, so this can pick it up. All right, ready? Yeah. <gasps> it's like a witch voice. Yeah. But hang on. Let's not talk because it's saying something. It said more, but we couldn't hear it. But did you hear that, girls? Yes? Yeah. Something yes, like that. but you want to know why we heard it clearer than all the rest? Mm -hmm. Because we walked to where she stepped her foot down on the ground. You're right. So I put my microphone to her voice, to, to her. So when she said yes, it picked this up. Because it was right up to her, yes. That's why we heard her clear. Holy Ain't shit. that fucking crazy? Is it? It is, that is crazy. That gave me the biggest That is shoes. freaking crazy. And what was that flashlight? Was that them? Dude, there was a whole flashlight up here. Yeah, I saw that. Well, let's go down and meet them and then we can take everyone up for one last room because if not, we'll be here all day. All right, dude, I'm blinded. Got, I can see anything. We got really good stuff and we have people telling us great messages. All right, guys, so we have really good messages. We got clear evidence. It's very clear, bro. I know. I mean, the voice. We have to go back down, get to our other friends, and we're gonna come up here as a group to do one last thing. And I think mm -hmm. we're gonna do it into the fire, uh, the fire roof yeah. room. The fire pit, that's where I- Fire pit. Oh shit, I just seen a light over there. In the freaking. See, my camera didn't pick it up. I seen like something move. <gasps> See? There was a tap. I was a tap. Yeah, it wants me to, I, I think, think it wants would. us to go there. Should we? Without I, I've seen a whole floating orb just there, and then you just heard the tap. Mm -hmm. I did. I think they literally are calling us, bro. Hang on, let's go. We're investigating. We don't even have tools. Hang on, I'm using my light now just to get over there. Okay. So let's just... Uh, All right. Let's just go by ourselves. Yeah, Because for now. If they ran, they have the spirit of fear. Yeah. And when you are so... When you're scared, it's a big possibility to get, get uh, oh possessed. Possessed. Yeah. yeah. There's a big chance of getting possessed when you're scared, and the fact that they mm -hmm. they, they, they ran, ran out going to us. Yeah. They're scared. So. We'll go in. I'm gonna turn my light back off. But question: Let's stand here in silence one more time, okay. because we need to hear that tap again. Yup. That was behind me. I saw a shadow behind you. Holy. I saw it clear. Dude, my camera definitely picked that up. Clear as a shadow. We're, dude, they're right on us. They're leading us here, I think. Dude, the orb, the tap, and right behind me, that tap freaked me the f out. We're being followed, bro. Holy All right, I'm gonna shut my light off one more time. If this tap's here, I might even, oh, we can't run. I might even run. Holy shit. Wait, wait, right. what's that? I, I, turn my, I don't know. I turn my light off for a second. All right, I'm showing you. Hang on. No, I'm just Whoa. gonna remain it. Turn on. Oh, fuck. That's okay. All right. All right. If you're with us right now, and you want us to go inside that room that we're right next to, give us another tap. I'm gonna do this. This is something I like to do. I'm gonna hold it, and we're gonna just go right up to the door. Mm -hmm. Ready? One, right. two, three. Who's in this room with us? Sino yung nandito sa room na to ngayon? What's that? Is that from downstairs? That was the bell from downstairs. Unless it's giving them a sign that we're in here. It's going off nonstop.
Downstairs. Is it because they're warning us from up here? I think so. Let's play this one back. It keeps going oh, off. Going off. Everything all makes sense. They don't want us here, bro. Yeah, they're saying should Josh and Zark come down. That's what Richard said. It's going off like crazy for them because we're in this room. Let's listen to this one time and we're gonna go down. Yo, yo, I have an idea. What? Try to... Oh, like, leave it in there? Here. All right, let's turn your light on so we can get some extra light then. That bell is going off nonstop. Awesome. Something's gonna happen to us, I feel like. Something bad. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it in there. Inside, yeah. All right, we're gonna not talk. One, two, three. I don't buy more. What's your name? What happened to you? I don't know what you Are you evil? Are you evil? Hear the dogs? Hear the dogs? Mm -hmm. Are you going to hurt us right now? Are you going to hurt us right now? We'll play this back and go downstairs. Wow. Is that a, a will? I don't know, I didn't hear much, I didn't hear anything. I didn't hear anything though. So, what the heck's going on? It brought us in this room for something. So, so maybe, maybe, maybe some good spirits are trying to protect us. That's why a good spirit is banging the, the bell. Hey, come over, come over, come over. It's something. Something is definitely warning us not to go here. I can feel it. It's so heavy. I don't even get Yo, it. That taps that was behind us, off. the light that, there was a little orb of light I seen that lit, let, led me here. And when it led me here, the tap happened right behind me. And, and we both saw the shadow. Correct. So what the hell? Yo. Did it? Okay. We're back now. Either way, I'm, I'll cut that bell so I can tell you guys what happened anyway. Hang on. Hang on. You just can't explain those things. Obviously, you can't explain any of this, so. Yeah, I mean, to wrap it all up, yeah. I literally called you guys <coughs> Yeah, it's weird because <coughs> I'm actually starting to feel sick. My throat's all swollen now. So I'm telling you, I, I got affected up there. I really did. So that's why even for me, I don't mind calling it because I'm starting to feel like tired All because of the, la the, the ladies in black room where your bang happened. Oh, we did have a door kind of open. It kept moving. Yo, 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 yeah, that, that's what happened. What's the red button? Yeah. Do you know so what that what could mean? Is, we're being followed, bro. I really do think so we're- what uh, happened is, we literally saw the, the, mm -hmm. the door moves. Mm -hmm. So the- my Zark found it moving before me. I thought it was the wind. But I'm starting to think I don't know anymore. There's no wind inside. I know, I know. There was wind. none. There was none. That is true. I don't know. It was just almost too good to be true moments. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's wow. So honestly, the highlight of our evidence is with these guys. <laughs> and that's literally oh, what so I cool. thought was going to happen. And that's why I wanted them to go up and not us. Something different, and it worked. That was my theory. So obviously, we just left the Diplo. We just said our peace outs. 
but it's so foggy and peaceful out here. And if you look right here, you can see what this place really looks like from the, from the distance. And it is creepy, but anyways, guys, like I said before, really cool video. And now that I left the place, I already am starting to feel better. So I really do feel like I was getting affected by something in there and it was starting to really drain me heavily. My throat is still hurting, but it's starting to go away. But my body, everything is, it was all messed up. My stomach was hurting. Really creepy, really crazy experience. Uh, place is totally haunted. Again, it's known as the one of the most haunted, if not the most haunted place in all of Philippines. And it's 100% one, if not the haunted hotel, uh, the most haunted hotel. So. I am really tired still. We are getting the hell out of here. Like I said, we're packing up our bags. Um, one thing though, if you are new here, subscribe. If you're not, still, thanks for watching. I have a Patreon and our Patreon is good because it helps us get here, helps us get into the Diplo and helps us travel the world to make more videos. If you guys are new here and you wanna check it out, that'd be cool. That link in the description down below. I have an Instagram where I take my photos. That's in there. I have merch, that's down there. Thanks everyone for the support. Rise above. Just get out there and explore. Peace and thanks for watching.